Greetings and welcome my brothers and sisters, this is Christopher. In this video I want to share with you some new war related dreams that I have received from the Lord and I believe that World War 3 is soon about to break out. Now this video will build upon the dreams and revelations of my previous video titled Word from the Lord, War is about to break out, Small World War. Now that video is on my channel, it's my last video, and a quick recap of that video for you. I shared about how I saw a news anchor uh, reporting that world markets were nosediving. I shared how I saw Christians celebrating after the Bitcoin flash crash, because they were able to buy cheap Bitcoin. I heard April crash, and I heard small world war, and short world war. I also heard long-term problems for them, and that was in relation to Russia due to the sanctions. I also heard a domino effect, and I had a word from Jesus, quote, war is about to break out, and another um, also received, Ukraine cities would have become like hot lava, and that was in respect of the plan of the enemy through uh, Russia to use nuclear weapons on Ukrainian cities, that Jesus was going to stop that. Okay, if you want more detail, just watch the video, just a quick recap before I share the new material. also had a dream that Poland would send troops to Ukraine, and regarding the flash crash of Bitcoin, I heard the words, here it is. Okay, that's a, that's a brief summary of the previous video. Since then, I've had numerous dreams, which I have posted on Z3 News, and that I've also posted on my new Telegram group, which will be in the description below. In this group, I will share different dreams and visions that I receive, and you are able to comment on them there. So it's a good way to have everything organized in one place, and the link will be below if you're interested. Now, I received a word that I haven't shared publicly, and this was on the 4th of January this year, and the word was six to eight weeks prophecy fulfilled. And I did share this with a few people privately, and I didn't know if this was good or bad, but I believed that it was from the Lord and that it was uh, something was gonna happen within that six to eight week time period. Now, time, time passed, and on the seventh week, which began on the 22nd of February, that was when Russia invaded Ukraine. It was on the 24th of February, and I believe that this is the prophecy fulfilled, and that this will be considered as the beginning of World War III. And I have numerous dreams about war and World War III on my channel, so I believe that that, what it, that is what it was in relation to. And this morning I saw as I woke up on an ABC article, I'll quote this, uh, Zelensky, World War III may have already started. Ukrainian President Vladimir Lezen uh, Zelensky gave an interview with US broadcaster NBC News after addressing the US Congress. Journalist Lester Holt asked him if he was worried about US President Joe Biden's concerns that certain actions could trigger World War III. Here is a translation, a translation of Mr. Lezensky's response. Quote, Nobody knows whether it may have already started and what is the possibility of this war in case Ukraine will fall. It is very hard to say, and we've seen this 80 years ago. When the Second World War had started, nobody would be able to predict when the full-scale war would start. Okay, so in that article, he's basically saying that World War III may have already started when Russia invaded Ukraine, and that nobody will be able to predict when the full-scale hostilities will break out. Now, I believe that that is the case based on what I have shared and what the Lord has shown me. Now, I will read uh, the dreams that I have posted 
on Z3 News and that are in my Telegram group. I'll read uh, portions of them. There will be some crypto flash crash related information in there as well because I believe that that event is linked to the war and I didn't know that um, until more recently. So I'll just read through these to share the new dreams that I've received about war. Okay, so on the 8th of March, I heard in a dream, Is this war? Yes, it is. A serious war. I also, on the 4th of March, I saw in a dream a pair of shorts with a red label that said Code Red. And I think that's like a, a market-related bearish dream. And on the 9th of March, I saw in a dream about Russia committing more troops into Ukraine. I received a figure over 330,000 total. Okay, I also heard in a dream warnings about GDAX. And a GDAX is a crypto exchange now called Coinbase Pro. So it's a bit of a warning about Coinbase. And I have another dream to share about that, just in case that you have funds on there. On the 13th of March, I saw in a dream a Russian soldier in a red-hued uniform and he seemed evil and dangerous. I then heard the word very impactfully, bloodshed. I also heard in a dream, times will be very hard. And later in the dream, I received the thought of Russia and I suddenly heard the sound of a big cat savagely growling like it was attacking something with its claws. Later, I heard in a dream, press the button. Uh, I didn't like the sound of that, so I prayed against that. I also heard the word, received the word communism. Okay, and uh, regarding war, what I believe the Lord showed me is that World War Three is about to break out. And I said in my previous video that I don't believe that this is the tribulation. So... I believe that World War III likely started when Russia invaded Ukraine on the 24th of February. And I believe that markets will plummet. I have what I've received so far as a quick summary is small world war, short world war, a serious war, bloodshed. Uh, so Russia is dangerous with the big cat savage growl, white hot in severity. Times will be very hard, communism, a domino effect, war is about to break out, nosedive. So these are the recent words that I received. I don't believe that this is the end yet, the tribulation, uh, but it is something quite bad and it may feel like it. Please seek the Lord Jesus Christ and prepare yourself spiritually, mentally and physically. And I'll discuss more about preparations later. Um, in an old dream over a year ago, I saw in Australia that the supermarkets were rationing food. Only um, a few customers at a time were able to enter the store to buy food. So that may be related to war and food shortage conditions. So it's important that you prepare yourself and with what you can do with the time that's left. Okay, on the 14th of March, uh, some different dreams and words that I received. In one dream, I saw a screen with a media report that the sides for World War III had formed. I saw that India had sided with Russia and China and North Korea. I saw that the Allies, NATO, including Turkey, were all together opposing them over Europe. I then saw the news reporting a series of major cyber attacks on companies, industries, countries that kept getting worse and the last one I saw was very severe and the dream ended. Then I received in a dream Putin's gas price 500. I looked up the main European gas price and it is at, uh, when I looked it up as of this post, it was at 131 euros. It was recently at 225 euros. So I expect this to increase to over 500 euros. 
That's my view on that. I also receive the word, they are setting their bombs. I also receive the word, tactical weapons. Now, this could involve preparation of tactical nuclear weapons. I also receive the word Ru Russo-China Alliance. This is perhaps showing the strongest two of their World War III alliance. I believe it's likely more countries than Russia will be on Russia and China's side, such as Syria and Iran. Now, I have a prophetic important dream and word from God regarding Russia and Iran invading Israel. And I'll share that in the description below. There's two dreams. Also, on, this, on the 14th of March, I had an abstract dream where I saw a tall cooking pot which represented Putin, the president of Russia, and I saw a one centimeter hole in the bottom. And as I saw this, large cracks started to form in the bottom and on the sides of the stainless steel pot. My interpretation of this is that Putin is made of steel, but he has a hole a weakness which will turn into large cracks so that eventually he will crack. I don't know what this means exactly. I also received in a dream about a forced withdrawal which I thought applied to Russia, China and may involve being forced to leave occupied territories. I also received the word Chechnya and this is a war fought by Russia where the main city Grozny was sieged and heavily destroyed by artillery and airstrikes, with the UN calling it the most destroyed city on earth. This may be an indication of Russian tactics against Kiev in Ukraine. Okay, and then the dream about Coinbase, a bit more explanation. I had a dream I was in a room which seemed like a strong bank vault with four inch st uh, thick steel walls, but there were two holes in the wall about four inches by four inches, a vulnerability. And I heard that they were having problems with two-factor authentication. So they announced a suspension of operations or withdrawals. I wasn't sure which one. So that doesn't sound good in terms of having your uh, finances on Coinbase. So just be aware of that and seek the Lord regarding that if there's a, a better place that you should have your funds. Okay, and... On the 15th of March, I heard in a dream, Russia escalates. And right after that, I heard a major attack. Also, I had a dream indicating that I believe the flash crash is coming soon. Um, I won't get into that. Then on the 16th of March, um, I shared on Z3 about a dream I had earlier, which was on the 9th of March. And in this dream... It was about something else, but in the dream, my brother said something. He said that, he said it with seriousness, that Russia and China's currencies were collapsing. Now, I believe this is signif uh, significant as based on current events, uh, China is being warned now by the West to not help Russia evade sanctions. And my dream could indicate that China may assist Russia in a way that brings sanctions upon them which might damage their economy or currency. That's my interpretation of that. Okay, and what I posted today, the 17th of March. So I had a dream where I heard the words circle the violation zone and protect it. And I knew this was NATO that was saying this. I then heard a news report saying, Germany approved using military force in Ukraine. I had the impression about military force being used to protect supply convoys to Ukraine. Then I saw a map and I saw a huge uh, greenish brown tsunami moving toward the Ukraine border and I knew it represented NATO forces. And I said to myself in the dream, is this it? World War Three? I believe that NATO is going to take action and will help Ukraine. Now, I'll share uh, one crypto-related dream also. I also had a crypto dream where I saw Bitcoin was at 11,000 and it went to 10,000. And I was thinking how the nosedive I heard previously was fulfilled and that it was a huge drop. 
Then I saw Bitcoin at 8,000 and I was in a room of other people and I said to them, did you see Bitcoin has gone under 10,000? Then the scene changed and I checked my phone and I saw that the Bitcoin flash crash had happened. And this was a, a Bitcoin chart on KuCoin and it appeared that the flash crash happened from around 8,000 down to zero or near zero. And at the bottom of the red candle, I saw the number 0 0.2. And then it went back up quickly um, and I didn't see what price it recovered to as it was off the screen but it didn't seem like it was low very long at all so that was the dream I believe that these things are very close and I believe that the the Bitcoin flash crash will be uh, related to these events like the war or the cyber attacks World War three these things like that so I didn't think that would be the case until more recently where the Lord has been showing me more clearly about it. So these are the dreams I wanted to share with you, the updated dreams regarding war and that World War III is really about to break out, though I believe it has already started. Um, so prepare yourself uh, spiritually, seek the Lord Jesus Christ for strength, support and be faithful and repent of your sins and prepare yourself mentally. I have a video where Jesus told me about sharing Psalm 27 when war breaks out. So read Psalm 27. It is a good psalm about the Lord's protection and deliverance even in war, wartime. And preparing physically, I believe that is important. I think it's good to have extra food, water, um, equipment, all the things that you would need to provide for yourself and your family with the time that is available. I have heard in the past about grain shortage. Uh, that was a long time ago and we're really seeing that now with Ukraine producing a significant amount of wheat as well as Russia. These things are all going to be affected, inflation, everything like that. So prepare according to how the Lord Jesus Christ leads you. And I just wanted to share that things are going to escalate. They're going to get a lot worse. And if you don't already have your or your Bitcoin orders in, make sure that you do. And await for the Lord's financial deliverance in terms of that. But other, aside from that, I believe that things are going to get pretty bad with war. And it's going to be very serious. It's going to be... a, a it's although I received small world war and short world war. Um, the previous world wars were four years and six years, so short might still be like a couple of years, or I don't know exactly. And small might be it's not fought in that many different places. Maybe it's primarily confined to Europe, but I still think it's going to be very serious, and there could be use of nuclear weapons and that this will be quite bad. So pray for our brothers and sisters in Christ who will be affected. Pray that they are faithful to the Lord Jesus Christ and pray that many others come to faith in Jesus and repent and be saved. And pray for peace also and for the deliverance of innocent people. And uh, thank you for hearing me. If you want to join the Telegram group, that will be below. God bless you your brother in Christ, Christopher.